This video is brought to you by the PowerBase Mini, a smaller, more compact alternative to the original PowerBase converter. Visit the link in the description below for more information. Team Canada. Here, look, there's three packages on the by the door. You see them? What do you think it is? A Ninja Turtle. You think it's Ninja Turtles? I think it might be video games. Well, maybe it's Ninja Turtles. Maybe it's Ninja Turtles? What else could it be? Uh, maybe it's... Leonardo. Leonardo? Yeah. I don't know. I think those are for Daddy. Look at those packages. Whoa. Can... Check out the three packages. Awesome. Can you carry one for Daddy? Okay, don't drop it. No, don't drop it, Teddo. Teddy, bring it inside. All right. Good job. Okay, bring them inside, guys. Teddy, don't throw it. You get the other one. Don't throw it, Teddo. Teddy, <laughs> careful. Hey, what's going on guys? CJR here today with another episode of the Sega Dream Quest. Uh, today, Andrew's here joining me. You want to say hi? Hi, everybody. It's me. Ha. Teddy's being very loud up there, isn't he? I told Mommy to ask Teddy to, to try and keep Teddy quiet, but that's not working out, is it? No. Very loud. Um... Welcome back to the Sega Dream Quest. This is episode three. I have a couple more packages here and uh, one trade that I did with somebody locally, actually. Um, uh, before, I, before I get to that, I just wanted to say that there's a, another YouTuber who is also doing um, a video series called the Sega Dream Quest. His name's uh, Gamer Emporium. I'll put a link to his channel in the description below. Feel free to go check out his channel. He actually came up with a name before I did. I, I, I had never heard of it, but once I posted, uh, once I posted that first video, um, somebody said that he was doing the same thing. So um, check out his channel. He's got a great channel, much like mine, and uh, he's doing the same thing I am right now. We're both trying to complete our Dreamcast uh, collections, and we both came up with that amazing name for the series. So um, good luck to the uh, to Gamer Emporium. Oh yeah. <laughs> What's that called? A boom jump. A boom jump? A drum roll. It's, it's time for the drum roll. We're gonna open the packages. How about you do this and try knocking? It'll make it easier. Okay, drum roll. Here comes package one. Uh, package number one is from Dean Robitaille. I hope you don't mind me using your name. But uh, thank you very much. Um, uh, this one was actually a donation, I believe. I'll know when I see the game. Yes, it was a donation. He just uh, contacted me and let me know that he had this game. And he wanted to uh, donate it to the collection. So thank you very much, Maybe Dean. I'm going to open it and show you it. Uh, thank you very much, Dean. Highly, highly appreciated. I just want to make sure that his address isn't showing here. Daddy, you can share that game for me? You know what? We can play it. We can try this game right after we do this, okay? Whoa, it's cool. This is cool. What Very is it? good condition. Show hey, me. What's that on the front? I know. Come. Froggy. A froggy, that's right. It's Frogger 2. Swampy's Revenge. Um, I never played this. I watched some videos on it. It's, it's kind of like they turned uh, Frogger into a platformer, which I don't know if that was the best idea. I don't know how many Frogger elements it still it retains, but I think you can actually play the original Frogger on here too. Um, single or multiplayer action up to uh, four players. So I'm pretty excited to try this. You and me are going to play this right after the video, okay? Yeah. So thank you very much, Dean, for donating that to the collection. Um, yeah, pretty excited to try that one. Now. Make sure he didn't make a note. Okay, no note. Very well packaged too. I'm gonna reuse those. That packing phone. 
Let's open the other one. Okay, we're going to open the other one. First, we're going to do this. I uh, just made a, um, a trade tonight with a uh, guy who watches the channel from Facebook, too. He's actually local. He lives about 15 minutes away. I traded a couple uh, PS1 games for these two games. The first one is Caesar's Palace 2000, another game I haven't played. Um, just your basic casino game. I think it's got like uh, uh, roulette, blackjack, craps, war, and a bunch of other stuff. And probably one of the, a tougher game to find for the Dreamcast these days, it's Egg, Elemental Gimmick Gear. Um, kind of a, an oddball uh, RPG. Again, I haven't played this. The art style looks very, very cool. I'm pretty excited to try this one out too. What? Don't tell mommy about this game? It'll be a secret, right? No, I don't tell Okay, we won't tell mommy. So um, this, these both come from um, Mike from Facebook. So thank you very much, Mike. Really appreciate that. Uh, two more games off the list. Um, I don't know if I mentioned, but I think I'm down to I'm, I'm down under 50 games now with these. I started at needing needing just over 60. So what I'll be doing again is uh, posting the updated list in the uh, description below of this video. So on to the final package. This is from uh, Shane uh, from Facebook again. Um, somebody who watches the, the YouTube videos. Uh, there's a little note here. Enclosed, just wait. Enclosed are some small gifts for Andrew and Teddy. We hope all these items arrive in good order. Uh, love your work, Shane and Kelly Taylor. So thank you very much, Shane and Kelly. Um, I believe I sent a PS3 game Shane's way, so this one was a trade. Look at this package. Can I hold one of those? Well, yeah, you can play with just a piece of foam. Nothing special. You want to okay, play with it? Oh, squishy dog. Yeah, it's squishy. It's, it's for making stuff. Yeah, it's for making stuff, yeah. Do this now. Or it's for packing stuff so it doesn't get broken when it ships. You need water for it, Daddy. Water for what? For this thing. Why would you need water? What will it do? You need cushion water. Oh, you think... It, no, it's not a sponge. Why? It's not a sponge. What do? It's for packing. How do you do it? Daddy, we're gonna see what's in here. This looks interesting. This stuff's for you and Teddy. What is this? I don't know, we're gonna find out. This looks like some pretty cool stuff in here, though. What? What do we got here? A Look skateboard. at that. A skateboard. What is it? You know who you can use that for? Hold the dip at one at a time. You know the rules. Yeah. One at a time, right? You know who you can use for this? What? We can put your Ninja Turtle on there. Skateboard. And there was, there was a Pazadding one. See, it's a little guy on the skateboard. What do we have here? Wow, look at this. Let's see what, what this is. is. Right look here. at that, it's a little Star Wars guy. What? How do you open it? Hey, you're going to fall down, be careful. The little Obi Wan. Oh my, you are gonna love this. It's a pen. Look at that. It's a Star Wars pen. Oh. Isn't that cool? Oh, and look at these. Oh my god, he's gonna love these. Check these out, Andrew. These are little picture frames. And you can color. You can color on the picture frame. Check it out. Look, with markers. I can't use one. Very cool. He, he loves coloring. He's gonna absolutely love this. So Andrew, the person who sent you this, their names are Shane and Kelly. Can you say thank you to Shane and Kelly on the video? Thank you, Th Shane and Kelly. Thank you, Shane and Kelly. Thank you, Shane and Kelly. Say, say thank you one more time. Say thank you, Shane and Kelly. Thank you, Shane and Kelly. <laughs> thank you very much, guys. He's going to love that. He's going to move on. To I like this. That's cool, isn't it? You're going to love these. We're going to color them, and you can put a little picture inside them. Okay, Robin goes on Robin's on the back. Cool. I'll Ninja Okay, he's leaving. He's going to play with his Ninja Turtles on, on the new skateboard. Um, so the game that uh, Shane sent me uh, via trade was um, 
Chronicles of Pern, Dragon Riders. I don't know anything about this game, to be honest. I know nothing about this. I think it's an RPG. Ubisoft. I really didn't even I didn't even know this game existed until um, I went through and posted the list of the games I didn't have. And then I looked it up because I've never heard of it. As far as I know, it's an RPG by Ubisoft. Pretty excited to try this one out. I almost forgot to mention, thank God that he put this in here. Um, Shane has a Facebook page uh, called Silversmith Games. Uh, he, he refurbishes and fixes a lot of consoles. Um, this is a very nice business card, Shane. Um, Silversmith Games, I'm going to post a link to it in the description below. I think he runs most of his stuff off his Facebook page, so I'll post a link for that. Um, uh, he sells games, accessories. But uh, I know he's big into fixing consoles, which is something that I really need to learn how to do. That's Silversmith Games. I'll leave that in the description below. Daddy, wasn't he for Teddy? Um, yes, one of those is for Teddy. Fantastic shape, too. Up. Thank you so much, Shane. Um, so that's it. Four more games off the list. Uh, once again, I the, the response to the Chronicles uh, are... Um, Sega Dream Quest um, videos and uh, has, has been fantastic. Uh, lots of people have been contacting me wanting to help out. Um, as always, if you have any Dreamcast games that you are wanting to get rid of, uh, feel free to let me know. Contact me through my Facebook page. That's the best way to do it. I'm going to say goodbye. We're going to say goodbye in one minute. So that's the end of the episode. Um, once again, thank you for all the help that you guys have given me and thank you for watching the episode. And uh, till the next episode. You want to say bye now? Bye, everybody. You want to say thank you to the people that say thank you for the stuff? Thank you for that. Thank you for this. He loves it. All right. Okay, guys. Until the next episode. It's like a needle, Daddy. What? It's like a needle. Yeah, it's like a needle. It's a pen, though. Till the next episode, guys. Need to sing I'm in Cuba right now, laying in the sun, hopefully getting a decent tan and uh, drinking and getting fat. Andrew, who dropped off these packages for us? The uh, mail sender. The mail sender? The mailman. The mailman. Yeah, or mail person. Should say right because it could be a could be a, a woman right a lady. Let's open it now. Okay, we can open it now. <laughs>